And now for a, a just a, a fascinating concept and a story I'm excited to talk about. A PhD student at Southern Methodist University's Lyle School of Engineering hopes a small sensor she's developed may one day help curb food waste in America. It's a sensor that can tell when food gets spoiled. Kendalyu Chawang joins us to talk about the innovation. Good morning, Kendalyu, and thanks for joining us. Hello, um, thank you for this opportunity. Mm. And thanks to the team also for having me. Of course, so, so we actually sent a photographer to your lab last week to see the sensor you've developed. How does it work? So um, this pH sensor, this is uh, miniature, disposable, and uh, mass producible. It is also uh, environmental friendly. Um, our collaborators have demonstrated the mass production of this pH sensor. Um, so this pH sensor, the bigger picture about this is to integrate with RFID tag and um, wirelessly provide pH information as the food is passed through checkpoints in um, harbors or supermarket centers. Yeah, and it, I mean, it's really small when you think about the amount of food it can save and the work it can do. We see it being used right now on some fruit. How do you see it being used? Do you see this as something that consumers would buy to test their own food? Or do you see it being built into to brands, to packaging like uh, we see at, at your lab? Um, I work with it team of very ambitious researchers and we are targeting using pH sensors to prevent food waste during logistics, meaning the food that is wasted post harvest before it reaches the grocery shelves or the kitchen shelves, because um, about 1.3 billion metric tons of food uh, are wasted globally, according to estimates by food and agricultural organizations of the United Nations. And also, according to Feeding America, about 40% of the food in the United States alone is wasted every year. And that is equivalent to 130 billion meals wasted each year. So that's why we, we want to target the food that is wasted during the logistics. And so, uh, yeah, like just to integrate them in food packaging and mm -hmm. wirelessly monitor them as it passes through the checkpoints for companies to be able to attach to their products. Now, Kandalu, I read that you grew up in a remote part of India where these types of agricultural goods, foods that can spoil, support that region. So this project must feel pretty personal to you. It is, yes. So I come from a part in India called Nagaland where 70% of the population is directly dependent on agriculture. And I know that there are consequences of food waste, most of which are um, hunger, malnourishment, and labor-intensive field work. So it is very personal to me, and I'm glad that I can work on something that is close to my heart. I mean, it is, it's a very impressive innovation and a very creative concept. Kandalyu, thank you so much for joining us, and, and best of luck with your work. We look forward to seeing it on the shelves. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for the invite.